Get your official XPW merchandise, t-shirts of the Messiah, Homeless Jimmy, Hungry Homeless and Hardcore, Don't Cross the Boss's Wife, I'm talking about Lizzie Borden. The official XPW logo t-shirt is Eight Your Daddy's Wrestling, Tag Team Superstars, The West Siders, Sabu, Scarred for Life, White Trash, Johnny Webb, Fried Chicken and Ass Kicking, our official XPW embroidered baseball cap with front and back logo. XPW's home videos of Lizzie Borden, Christy Miss, XPW TV's The Revolution Will Be Televised, Baptized in Blood, Hardcore Conception, and 8x10 Glossies of your favorite XPW stars. Get your official XPW merchandise today. Do you think you have what it takes to become a pro wrestler? Then check out The Asylum, the official pro wrestling training school of XPW. For more information, call 818-779-6479 or log on to www.xpwrestling.com. July 22nd, live at the LA Sports Arena, XPW presents the one-year anniversary spectacular. In the main event, XPW champion, Sabu, puts the title on the line against his most formidable foe as Rob Blackbridge's Terry Fox at XPW. Their battles are legendary, and now XPW will experience the carnage. Tickets to the Super Show available at all ticket has a location. July 22nd, 8 p.m., the LA Sports Arena, Rob Black says to Sabu and Lazy, go fuck yourself. Good evening, wrestling fan, and welcome to another edition of XPW TV. I am Larry Rivera, still the host of the show. This guy over here is Chris Cross. Wait, oh! Hey, brother, how are you feeling tonight? What are you doing? You feeling okay, man? How am I feeling? I'm a little sore, just a little bit. I got the bump on the head. You were holding me down while Rob Black was beating hey, on me. Hey, brother. Te dije, what did I tell you, man? Like my tia used to say in Cuba, si no respeta a la gente, te van a dar un galletazo, brother. You reaping what you sow. And now that Robert Black has revealed his big plan, that Terry Funk is going to be the next big opponent for Sabu. He also sent Sabu up to Canada for punishment, man. Now that that is all happened, we are going to be able to show the footage from Vengeance. You mean finally we can see Sabu versus Abdul the Butcher? And we're going to see big... Hey, 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 wait. Espérate, brother. I say we can show the footage, but you can't rub it in the face of the boss. We are <laughs> okay, also going okay. to take we're going to take a look at something very strange, something bizarre that happened at Vengeance. This happened while Robert Black was telling the fans how Abdullah the Butcher is going to get Vengeance. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to XPW TV. Larry Rivera, here we are, the LA Sports Arena. Thousands on hand as we see Rob Black with his army is always now. That's right, look at the soldiers. The soldiers united behind the leader, Robert Black, the mafia of Robert Black, right here in the beautiful Sport Arena in Los Angeles, California. And don't forget about Lizzie Borden. And here comes this monster crack. I mean, this guy is huge, Rivera. He's a big guy. He's reminding me of somebody who like, likes the children, likes the little boy. Likes the what? He's, he's a big guy, man. He goes around the street. Oh, wait, don't go there. Looking for abuse. A few weeks ago, we saw what happened here on XPW TV and the Messiah. Look at that guy, man. He's a big, crazy guy. Crack. I don't want any part of that guy. Look at what he's in the ring, that beautiful Lizzie boy. I tell you, man, this is the fringe benefit of working well, here in the XPW. We're very calm down right now. The most important thing I want to know is what your guy Black, I mean, what does he possibly have to say this week here on XPW TV as we see Steve Verzano, the top cool one, Jake Wallace, Tracy Smothers, John Curtis. What an arsenal. Look at this fan of maniacs. This fan of misfits. That guy, look at this guy, Lawless. I never liked this guy Lawless, you know, he cost my boy Carlito the match that time. He's a coward, man. He always has to be a part of some kind of gang, some kind of gang family mentality. That is true. I mean, starting off with the hierarchy here at XPW, now going right into Rob Black. So, I mean, I will agree with you on that Carlito part. 
Hey, Chris Cos, why don't you tell these people to show a little bit of more respect for the president, for the main man, Robert Black, Chico. Look at this, Rob Black can't even talk. He's getting what he deserves. The fans here in Los Angeles knows what he's been doing. I mean, lazy. You want to talk about a guy in charge? He's the guy that was saving this company. This guy's putting it right into the gutter. I can't believe these people, they can't let him talk. Show some respect. Oh, carajo, oye, hey, man. Hey, you're a jackass. You people got no respect. All right, let's hear from Rob Black. a little boy in Cuba, my father told me to show respect to the older man, to the little guy, to everyone around you. Hey, what is this? Hey, what's happening here, man? Who is this guy? Who is this guy? You know about the this fans, guy? What are the fans running in the ring now? They have the liberty to jump in. Where's the security? And he's attacked. Where is the security? And this guy is going right after Jake Wallace. What is happening here? Oh. There is no control here in the sport arena. It's out of control. It's a riot. Are you talking about the Lakers? He's going crazy. He's out of control. Calm down. We've got to get someone out here. You're exactly right. I mean, this monster, Jake Lawson, 
literally being manhandled by this guy. Look at, look at the size, the massive arm. Jake Lawless, easily 6'5", 300 pounds. This guy's throwing him around like a rock doll, like a, like a yeah yo. And look at them stomping away now on the head of Jake Lawless. Measuring him now with the fist right to the head. We gotta get someone out of here. If someone can hear me from the back, please. Please. Uh, You're Mendos. Iris Mendos. here. Close line. I mean, this guy's got some wrestling ability, Rivera. He's a big guy. Tremendous physical. He stay it will say taquitando it seemed too long. Just like his... my father used to do when I was a little boy. I did the bad things. He take all these seem too long. He's got the belt. Well, come on. Well, what, what, what Jake Lawless deserve from this guy? What, what is it that we don't know here? Look, at, he's got the oh, buckle oh, right with the buckle. The belt buckle the right buckle. between the eyes. Right in the forehead, making him the blood oh, probably. Oh, I guarantee you we're going to see some blood right now. Who in the world is this guy? Jake Lawless down and out. I don't know, I can't tell if he's busted wide open, but this guy just manhandling Wallace. He is, he is busted open, he is. Boy, look at the blood, it's coming from the head. Oh, Jake Lawless, he's putting the foot in the face, kicking it in the nose. Stiff stomps now to the head by this guy. I mean, it, he's obviously, he's got some sort of uh, fighting background, professional wrestling martial. He's biting him. Look at the biting, biting him in the forehead. Hey, man, you listen to what these guys are saying, these crazy people. Yeah, they're chanting AIDS. Look at the forehead. AIDS. Para la gente de the Latin community, they are saying SIDA. That gets you the, the intelligent mentality of this XPW fan. No, 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 no. They're just chanting AIDS. Look at this now. Irish Whip coming up. Reversal from Jake Lawless. Look at Jake Lawless. Oh, could you reverse deck breaker? He has no power. Jake Lawless is a big, tough guy. But this guy. Finally! Look at finally it. Finally, we get security out here. Look, he's finally, got the we blood. Get some referees out here. Who the hell is this guy? Get him the hell out of here right now. He's got blood in his mouth, blood in his face. I can't believe it. I have no idea who this is coming out to attack one of Rob Black's henchmen. Hey, what are these fans saying? Red shoes? Red shoes? He's got red shoes. I know Tom Hanks had one. Red shoe. Hey Chico, the only red shoes I know is the world famous referee Johnny Red Shoes Dugan from the 60 and 70 at the Olympic Auditorium. But I had no idea. I had no idea who this guy is. Look at how he left Jake Lawless laying in a pool in a puddle of his own blood Jake, in the middle of the ring. Jake Lawless busted wide open and now fellow Rob Black henchman coming to help out. Jake Lawless along with XPW officials, XPW referees. This guy cracked, he's not happy, he's pissed off. I don't blame him. This guy, he jumped out of the crowd. He should have been grabbed by the security and escorted outside and put in a police car taken to Yale. Who is this guy, man? There's more to come here on XPW TV. Stay with us. Huh? I don't even want to know. Listen, Rob pulled some kind of scam. Me and Sabu are going up to Canada to stampede really? to defend the belt. we got to keep the belt around his waist. What I need for you to do is run things while I'm gone. Okay. You're in charge. No problem. All right? You know what I want. You know what I don't want. I know how you like it. Okay. If there's any problems and you blow it, we have Sabu come back. Chop you up into a million little pieces. No. He already doesn't like you. No, no problems. no problems. First thing I need you to do, Chaos called me earlier today. He wanted to have a meeting. I can't do it. I got to go. Okay. All right? You take care of him. No problem. Whatever he problem. wants, you give it to him. Whatever he wants. I'll take care of Chaos. All right. I'm going to go. You want to walk me to the car? Um, All right. I'm going to go. See you later. Later. Oh, you're disgusting. <laughs> Get your official XPW merchandise, T-shirt of the Messiah, Homeless Jimmy, Hungry Homeless and Hardcore, Don't Cross the Boss's Wife, I'm talking about Lizzie Borden. The official XPW logo T-shirt is Ain't Your Daddy's Wrestling, Tag Team Superstars, The West Sider, Sabu, Scarred for Life, White Trash, Johnny Webb, Fried Chicken and Ass Kicking, our official XPW embroidered baseball cap with front and back 
logo. XPW's home videos of Lizzie Borden. Christy Miss, XPW TV's The Revolution will be televised. Baptized in blood, hardcore conception, and 8x10 glossies of your favorite XPW stars. Get your official XPW merchandise today. Visit XPW's official website at www.xpwrestling.com or call the XPW hotline at 818-779-6475. Do you think you have what it takes to become a pro wrestler? Then check out The Asylum, the official pro wrestling training school of XPW. For more information, call 818-779-6479 or log on to www.xpwrestling.com. July 22nd, live at the LA Sports Arena, XPW presents a one-year anniversary spectacular. In the main event, XPW champion Sabu puts the title on the line against his most formidable foe as Rob Black brings Terry Fox to XPW. Their battles are legendary now. XPW will experience the carnage. Tickets to the Super Show available at all Ticketmaster locations. July 22nd, 8 p.m., the LA Sports Arena, Rob Black says to Sabu and Lazy, go fuck yourself. How bizarre was that? I mean, this guy, he just comes out of the crowd, attacks Jake Lawless, opened him right up, started biting him, leaves him with a crimson mask, and then the guy just left, period. What was that all about? That was crazy. Who was that guy? That was crazy, man. I don't know what was happening there, but if you ask me, we still need a little more explanation on what this guy is all about, man. Now, last week, fans, we saw John Cronus completely decimate Mr. 80's Dynamite Thief for making a complete fool out of Lizzie Borden by pretending to be the Macho Man. Remember yes, that? yeah, I remember that too, man. We also saw this big guy, the monster, Tool, come to the ring to the aid of Sabu, and he also got rid of the Robert Black and his army, sent him running from the ring, man. That's right, and to make him pay, Rob Black signed a match between Tool and his right-hand man, John Cronus. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to XPW TV, back here at the LA Sports Arena, as we see John Cronus, of course, Rob Black's henchman, and Lizzie Borden's bodyguard coming to the ring. That's correct, Chris Claus, the Los Angeles Sport Arena, one time home to the Los Angeles Clippers, but no longer, Chico. This is the home of XPW, am I correct? Aren't you exactly correct? Tremendous wrestling events through the years have taken place in this historic building. But right now, everybody's talking about XPW as John Cronus gets set for battle against another monster. Ooh, a lot of fun. A lot of fun here in awe of this guy, John Cronus. Big guy. Big agility guy. The member of the Royal Black Army. Proud member, proud soldier. And also a long time bodyguard of the beautiful Lisi Borden. From just about day one, he was the bodyguard of Lizzie Borden as we hear the music. I mean, this guy, Tool. What waves he's made here in XPW undefeated. And what was the deal last week on XPW TV? He came out to the ring, and he just about cleared every henchman of Rob Black. I mean, is this guy siding with Lazy? Is he looking out for himself? I mean, no one knows. He can't talk to the guy. This is absolutely correct, Chris Cross. The question mark is in everybody's head. Where is this guy? Where is this guy too going to go? Is he going with Lacey? Is he going with Robert Black? To be honest with you, from the mind of Larry Rivera, this is the guy who's big enough, who is powerful enough to make his own decision. He can even form his own group, his own faction, if he wanted to. He is that powerful. Well, nonetheless, cool. Where is he going? He's going to the ring. He's going to face John Cronus right now. Two huge monsters locking up. And look at these fans. He's a couple eight. of them went to touch Tool and then immediately backed off a few of them. Boy. I mean, look how he towers over these fans who are already elevated in the bleacher section on the floor here. He finally have to climb. Se tienen que encaramar en la silla, chico. They have to climb in the chair. Huh? To touch Tool in the head. 
But I want to tell you, man, if Robert Black can make some kind of plan, some, some kind of, of something to get this guy in the army, you know what kind of coup? That will be the coup d'etat, Chico. That will be great. A beautiful move. And the Monster Tool steps easily over that top rope, blaring out to the fans. Look at those eyes. He's mean. This guy is mean. I see him in the back, in the back when he's getting ready for the matches. Nobody get close to him. Cronus! It's John Cronus. And his opponent from Sin City, Tool. All right, let's get that idiot out of the ring and let's get the action. Let's get the Tool. Let's get the John Cronus. You know, Chris Cross, I've been talking to a lot of SPW fans that are still disturbed. They cannot sleep from the tool video that they showed a few weeks ago on the XPW TV oh, yeah. when he's in the room with that woman. Can you believe it? I, I believe, I, I, I've heard that that was down in his dungeon. He's got all sorts of different tools. And they had no the, pun intended. The nightmare, Chico, nightmare, they can't slip. John Cronus, though, showing no intimidation, apparently. Hey, if I was this Cronus, I watch what I'm doing. I show a little respect. Power and elbow tie-up coming up now. Tool locking up with Cronus. Both men shove each other off, and, and apparently matching up pretty well with strength there. This is a good point. I was going to bring up this close. Finally, Tool has someone that is approximately his side. Right now, arm ringer from Tool. Oh, we've seen this before. But look at this guy flip over. Arm drag on the Cronus, the size of this guy on oh, the power and the agility hand in hand. That was just one of the many trademark moves that are exhibiting of the tool agility in the ring. I have compared him in the past to Don Leo Jonathan, Andre the Giant when he was a little boy. Larry Big Rivera, guys. Larry Rivera, I'm gonna go on record. This guy tool has shown me so much here in XPW. This guy is a future of XPW. This could be the future XPW champ. Look at this guy tool. I agree with you, with guys like the Messiah, John Cronu, all these guys, XPW. He's going to be on the top, Chico. Cool now. Forearms to the back of John Cronus. Shot now right to the throat. A rake of the eyes now from Cronus. Young Cronus, man. He's got the power. Although he doesn't look like it. Look at him lifting up for a big body slam. You imagine the power that that takes to lift, lift the guy like Tool off the feet. John Cronus now from the top. Look at that flip over right onto Tool. Going for the pin. Pee Wee Moore down. Only two. The flipping flying head butt. He's diving in the head like a pescado, Chico. Like a who? <laughs> it's John Cronin. Like a bird, like a pescado. Un pa un pajarito. Un pajaro, right? Cool now. Look at the power. Oh, the head right to the oh. chin of John Cronin. Coming down with that weight of his own body crashing on his jaw. Now out to the concrete floor here at the sports arena. You're right, though. Tool finally got a match. Look at, the, look at his size. The, the photographer from all over the world are here for the XPW matches in the beautiful Sport Arena. You're exactly right. For the fans that have come out, you know, international photographers from all around the world. They better get out of the way because the danger and the mayhem between these two guys is going all over the place. And now Tool attempting to choke John Cronus on the security railing here at the LA Sports Arena. Referee Pee Wee Moore, I guess, trying to reprimand Tool as best he can. I love it, man. I love it when we see the confrontation between two big, tough guys evenly matched. No, no way of deciding who's going to be on top. But the question mark is still in the head of the people as to where this guy, Tool, He's going to decide to go. And look at the block. Busted wide open. John Cronin. Blood spewing out of the forehead. And two. Look at him. Just like a nookie almost. Digging. Right He's digging the knuckle in the forehead. Digging in there, brother. Trying to get to the bone, to the skull. And now John Cronin just slings Tool into the security railing and Tool. Oh. Tool feels no pain. You can throw him in the guardrail, throw him in the tail, and he turn, turn buckle. No effect. Feels no pain. And now John Cronus, he's got on the timekeeper's table. Text one, two, black, two goes through the table. My commendation to John Cronus for that beautiful suit play on the table outside the ring. Outside of the ring, both men laid out on the concrete floor. One on top, and look at two getting up. Getting up first before Cronus, after he went through the table, Rivera. Two showing remarkable recovery, a skill 
Can you see that? He, he feels no pain, man. I'm telling you, this guy, Tool's got a tremendous future as John Cronus delivers the spinning heel kick on to Tool. The knee connected with the face of Tool as Cronus is heading up to the high altitude. The third rope. Famous for his top rope antics. Oh, look at that flip. Flip splash over on the Tool. A bit of a reverse there. And John Cronus, what's he doing? What is he doing? Why is he going for the pin? He's no, talking. Come on! He's talking to the fan. I think this guy Crono sometimes oh. needs a little mental evaluation because he's he goes off into his, this. his Re crazy a, a scenario. Rivera's going for the stuff bomb! He delivered a stuff bomb on that monster Cronus! You have got to be kidding me! Pay me more down for the can, it's over! That's a sweet count for Tool. I am telling you, man, along with guys like the Messiah, this guy is big, huge. He's gonna put SPW on top. It doesn't matter who he is aligned with. What a victory that was for Tool. Still to come, ladies and gentlemen, here on XPW TV in our main event. We will see XPW Champ Sabu defend against Abdullah the Butcher. What a battle that should be. Get your official XPW merchandise, t-shirts of the Messiah, Homeless Jimmy, Hungry Homeless and Hardcore. Don't cross the boss's wife. I'm talking about Lizzie Borden. The official XPW logo t-shirt This ain't your daddy's wrestling. Tag team superstars, the West Siders. Sabu, scarred for life. White trash, Johnny Webb, fried chicken and ass kicking. Our official XPW embroidered baseball cap with front and back logo. XPW's home videos of Lizzie Borden. Christy Miss. XPW TV's The Revolution will be televised, baptized in blood, hardcore conception, and 8x10 glossies of your favorite XPW stars. Get your official XPW merchandise today. Visit XPW's official website at www.xpwrestling.com or call the XPW hotline at 818-779-6475. Do you think you have what it takes to become a pro wrestler? Then check out The Asylum, the official pro wrestling training school of XPW. For more information, call 818-779-6479 or log on to www xprustling.com July 22nd live at the LA Sports Arena XPW presents a one year anniversary of Spectacular in the main event XPW champion Sabu puts the title on the line against his most formidable foe as Rob Black brings Terry Fox to XPW their battles are legendary and now XPW will experience the carnage tickets to the Super Show available at all Ticketmaster locations July 22nd 8 p.m. The LA Sports Arena, Rob Black says the Sabu and Lazy, go fuck yourself. You know, there are very few things that are for certain here in the world of professional wrestling, but I venture to say that Tool will certainly make a huge impact right here at XPW. That's correct, Chris Cross. There is no denying in the mind of Larry Rivera that Tool will be having a major impact, big force here in XPW. But Chris Claus, let's go to another subject, that of the humanitarian side of the great Robert Black. We saw how he's giving his wife all the presents, the beautiful new car. But you know, this Robert Black is a very busy man, and he forgot, he forgot one present that he was going to give to her, man. Let's, let's check out the footage of, right. what this, of what this gift could be. Right now, we're going to see the right footage. Right now, let's check it out. What could it be? Honey, what? What do you want me to return your call for? Another gift? Where? In the trunk? When did you put it in there? Two days ago? Ugh. Well, you know what? I'm getting ready to go jogging, so I'll just get it afterwards, okay? Please, let me just get it afterwards, okay? I love you. I love you. Bye. <gasps> oh, yes! Robert finally got me my own pet! Oh, come on, get out! Let's go! Come on! Aww. Let's be careful. Oh, you must be tired. 
It's been there for two days. How you doing? I'm hot. I'm tired. I'm tired? But don't be too tired. We got a lot of things to do. We gotta go shopping. Grocery shopping, that is. We gotta go to the mall. We gotta do laundry. Or actually, you gotta do the laundry. Come on. Oh my gosh, Robert, you are never going to believe this. We were at the grocery store, and they have this line of course, 10 items or less, and like, we have like four items, and they have Sorry. Gosh. You know what? She has a weak heart. I don't even know why we have her. I, I'm so out of it right now, I can't even talk. Okay, I'll call you back. But can't you do anything right? Honey, I'm sorry. You know what? After you get some putting those groceries away, clean the lawn jockey because he best thinks he's got spider webs and is so not proper. Oh, come on. It's not good. Oh, you, I'm sorry. sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Yes, Monday I'm going to be on night show. Yeah. yeah. Miss Warden? Uh, hold on a second, please. I finished uh, all your laundry. Mm -hmm. I vacuumed the house. Give me something cold to drink. Go, go. Okay. Gosh, that was so hard to find. I know. We just got this new one and she's just, she's ditzy. She's just a ditzy blonde. Yeah. Here. I didn't know what you wanted, so I brought you a variety of things. Such a pepper. Thank you. Okay. This is hot. You're such a clutch. Yes. Yes, I know, I know. I'm so excited. I'm just like... Ugh. Get your official XPW merchandise, t-shirt of the Messiah, Homeless Jimmy, Hungry Homeless and Hardcore, Don't Cross the Boss's Wife, I'm talking about Lizzie Borden, the official XPW logo t-shirt, it's eight your daddy's wrestling, tag team superstars, the West Sider, Sabu, Scarred for Life, White Trash, Johnny Webb, Fried Chicken and Ass Kicking, our official XPW embroidered baseball cap with front and back logo. XPW's home videos of Lizzie Borden. Christy Miss, XPW TV's The Revolution Will Be Televised, Baptized in Blood, Hardcore Conception, and 8x10 Glossies of your favorite XPW stars get your official XPW merchandise today. Visit XPW's official website at www.xpwrestling.com or call the XPW hotline at 818-779-6475. Do you think you have what it takes to become a pro wrestler? Then check out The Asylum, the official pro wrestling training school of XPW. For more information, call 818-779-6479 or log on to www.xpwrestling.com. July 22nd, live at the LA Sports Arena, XPW presents a one-year anniversary spectacular. In the main event, XPW champion, Sabu, puts the title on the line against his most formidable foe as Rob Black brings Terry Fox to XPW. Their battles are legendary now, XPW will experience the carnage. Tickets to the Super Show available at all Ticketmaster locations. July 22nd, 8 p.m., the LA Sports Arena, Rob Black says to Sabu and Lazy, go fuck yourself. Hey, Lazy. Where's Lazy? Uh, Lazy had to go out of town on, on business uh, with Sabu, but uh, he told me you were coming in and uh, to give you anything you want, Sam. 
I'm, I'm in charge. So you're in charge? I'm, I'm in charge. All right, I have a couple issues I need to take care of. Shoot, camp. I've been screwed over one too many times by Rob Black and his army. Mm-hmm. So check this out. I want Rosano, Kid Chaos, July 22nd at the LA Sports Arena. But not just in a regular match. We already did that. In a submission match. Chaos, I don't know what. No, but, but, but check this out. If I make Rosano say I quit, it's not only going to embarrass Rosano, it's going to embarrass Rob Black and his army. I quit, huh? I cannot wrestle that bum. I'll tell you what. I, I like that. Steve Rosano, Kid Chaos, in an I quit match. You got it, champ. Got it? Got I, can it. Count, I can count on you? Sorry about that. Uh, you can count on me, pal. All right, thanks, Kevin. You know, anything lazy and you want, you got it. You're all right. All right, you take care. Hey, got something for you. Okay, okay, let's go, Larry. I'm dying to show the vengeance match between Sabu and Abdullah the Butcher. Come on, we gotta, we gotta show. I love it. I love it. I can't wait. We're going to show the footage yeah. in a minute. But I want you to understand that you have driven Robert Black to this. You are lazy, and the XPW fan have driven Robert Black to go out and get Terry Funk, the world famous legend, to come to Los Angeles on Saturday, July 22nd at the LA Sport Arena. You have driven it to it. He's going to come and destroy Sabu. Calm He's down. He's going to be on your head. On your head. You understand what I'm saying? He's going to be at your head, man. Oh, come on, the arm, man. We're going to go to this footage now. Let's show the footage. Calm down. This cross, you can go funk yourself, man. Go funk myself? Ladies and gentlemen, here it is. Our main event this week on XPW TV. As we see Josh Lazy leading the way for XPW World Heavyweight Champion, Sabu. As he defends the title. That's right, the title is on the line. Here at the LA Sports Arena against Abdullah the Butcher. Chris Cross, this is the moment the world has been waiting for. All the people in professional wrestling are waiting for this moment when the clash between Sabu and Abdullah the Butcher finally has happened. Can you imagine the amount of history, the amount of lineage that is behind this match? Well, Sabu, I mean, so much history. I mean, these guys have been up and down the road all over the world, and it all finally pops here in Los Angeles, California. I mean, Rob Black, we've been waiting since D-Day for this match. As Rob Black brought Abdullah the Butcher out with that D-Day surprise, it was Abdullah the Butcher. As we hear the music of Abdullah the Butcher, of course, the music of Rob Black. That's correct, the main man. But right now, I want to go into a little bit of the history of these guys. Everybody knows that the uncle of Sabu is the one and only the original chick, and the chick, the chick from Detroit, Michigan, Chico. And this guy, they have a big feud going back to the 60s. Chick in the Abdullah the Butcher, man. At one time they were tag team. At one time they were not a tag team. In 1976, they won the real world tag league in Japan. One of the most prestigious tag team titles in the world. And after a while, they broke up his beauty, arguing. This has much history, man. Much history between Abdullah the Butcher, Sabu, and the Chick. But tonight is finally coming to a head, to a pit, to a boiling point between Sabu and Abdullah. Not only that XPW title at stake, but like you were saying, Rivera, so much, so much family history in this match. I mean, Abdullah the Butcher, we could see a new... XPW champ here tonight in LA. This is what you can truly call a blood feud. A feud of blood and hatred running through the veins of these professional athletes. Sabu, look at him all scarred up in the ring. So many battles he's been in. We talk about so many battles. I'm doing as well. Look at this! Right away, right away, Sabu with the spike in his hand. Look at that, jabbing Abdullah in the forehead. This is going to be nothing but violent crap. If you fans don't Whoa. like it, turn the channel because this is all violent crap. It's all it's going to be, man. Abdullah in the early goings of this match already busted wide open. Sabu's got that spike, that steel spike. Referee Pee Wee, whatever his name is, Whoa. trying in vain to control this match. It's no, it's no use to have this guy in the ring. All it's good for is to count the one, two, three. That's Lazy's it. 
Lee Jin just sent a chair into Sabu, and Sabu just wailed Abdul the Butcher on the back of the head. What's he got now? He's putting it in the neck, the spike. Once again, I have to commend Lacey oh. for the tremendous open body strength. You see the way he threw the chair. It was just a chair, Rivera. To Sabu. But look at this Abdullah, man. He's, he's in, in a world of, a sea of blood, a what world we, of pain. What have we been, one, two minutes in this match? Sa Sabu already, look at this, busted wide open is Abdullah the Butcher. I mean, come on. There is absolutely no technique involved in this match. No Greco-Roman, no catch as catch can. Like, you know what, brother? Of course not. Do you think that Stanislaus Zabisco would be involved in a match like this, Chico? What? Never in my, in my imagination. What are you would talking I, would about? I imagine that? Look at it, he's even got blood in the back. Abdul the Butcher already down. And Sabu still with that spike in his hand. He has blood in his back. Man. And look at this now. Wait a minute. If, let's get a camera over on the ringside. Looks like Abdullah the Butcher collapsed from exhaustion. Oh, on the man. ringside table. Whoa, he oh. just moved out of the way, too. Abdullah got out of the way just in time, Chico. Look at that, man. Sabu, I don't think the ropes are tight enough to the specification well, that Sabu would like. Abdullah but, the Butcher, I mean, he was just walking. I know we didn't have a camera down there, but he, he collapsed on that ring table. I can Looks understand, like he, man. He's lost a lot of blood in this match. He is spending a lot of energy in this match trying to keep up. He looks like he's going for the table. He could under be the going ring. for a table. He's could going for the table, man. Sabu's looking for something, too. Looks like they could be fighting over something. They got what is this? Hey. He's got a 40. Hey, he's got a... Hey, man, what? Got a 40 ounce. What is that? Old E? Look at oh, that. look at that. Abdullah is crazy drinking the old English. The old English. Oh, no, the no, no, no. Oh, he's, oh, yeah, he, he's got a shard of glass. A shard look of glass. At look at that. Look at this, man. <laughs> this is... Oh, oh yeah, man, brother. We got to... No. Call the police. This is... This, this is, is way too much. This, this is, is a new level of violent crap. A new experimentation. You can see the blood right away immediately. After Abdullah the Butcher just breaks Sabu with that shard of glass from that bottle. This is nothing short of legal murder. Legal assault. No! Assault no! Right on the top of the skull with that shard of glass. This is sick. This, I'm actually agreeing with you on this one. I can't. I've never seen anything like this before. If there is any police in look the at building. The, look at the fan. Come to the ring site. I mean, some of them are liking it. But some of them are standing off here at the sports ring. Look at his face. What a madman. What a sicko. El tenedor. El tenedor, brother. It's time for dinner with Abdullah. He guys the fork. Look at the eyes. He's mentally deranged. He's glaring everywhere. He's the madman of the Sudan. I mean, look at him. Look, this is so casual for him. Look at him walk around just stabbing people. What a nut. You know, brother, I never in my, my mind would imagine that I would be sitting here looking at this display of violent crap, man. I mean, you can hear the fans around us right now, Rivera. I mean, even they're in awe. And look at Sabu continuing to be busted open all over his body. Oye, bro, de que mara. Oye, eso es una cosa. Sabu can't even like lift his arm. His arm is completely dead, like a cripple, like a handicap. He can't move it, man. Earlier on in the match, Abdul the Butcher losing so much blood, paling in comparison now to the blood Sabu's losing. Continuing to stab him with that shard of glass. Look at these scars. These scars on, on Sabu. He can count about three or four more to add to, to his collection exactly. of these scars in the morning. Right between the eyes now with that glass. He's got one big, big cut in the forehead. Now look at the fans trying to help out Sabu. If we can get a camera around the side, I mean, Sabu, one of his arms would just rake right open. Blood's dripping everywhere around here. I mean, everywhere. Look at the tremendous muscular development of, of Abdullah the Butcher. Look at the, he must spend all the time in the gym. Look at him doing the bench press. No, 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 no. Body you, press, you Chico. Mean, you mean Sabu is what you mean. No, I'm talking about Abdullah. Look at that, man, the chest. Big 46 inch. Look check. at this. Look at the glass. Look at his arms. Sabu. Sabu fighting back. What heart. Look at this guy. Out of control. Completely out of control. Something flew out of the hand of, of Abdullah. I couldn't get a clear picture. Apparently, Josh Lazy. I don't know if he threw something into the ring. I think Sabu or not. El tenedor se le puede de Abdullah. He went flying out of the ring. Rob Black and Josh Lazy still at ringside. Oh, look at that counter now. 
by Abdullah Butcher. Shot right to the larynx of Sabu. Showing that martial art training that Sabu had from Japan many years in the Orient. Look at all the blood in the ring. What a mess. Oh, Josh Lindsay! Josh Lindsay gets got stabbed right in the forehead. And Sabu comes to the rescue. Lazy's down. You know, I'm going to tell you, man, this guy's lazy, lousy, whatever you guys it's call it. It's lazy. Him. He's never going to learn. He keeps interfering with Wait the a main minute. man with Abdullah the Butcher. He's going to, hey. Speaking of interfering, Rob Black's got the fork, but he gets played out by Sabu. You can hear it. You Sabu. can hear that shot, Rob Black. Oh, no. Oh, Is that yeah. in his eye? He's, oh, you yeah, man. It's this about time. Once again, I, I am sort of getting a, a little bit of pleasure, a little bit of joy of seeing the, the block run. Look at this now, the henchman Rob Black, John Cronin, Tracy Smother, Steve Rosano. Ah! Ah! Referees already called for the bell. This match is over, obviously disqualified. The bell is Abdullah ringing. The butcher. The bell has been ringing. Abdullah has no, he can't even hear what is going on. He has no idea what is happening. Wait a minute. Listen, that, that's true music. That's the music of Tool. He's back. He's back again. Oh, no, man. This is this is getting crazy. Look at this. Ah. Finally. Is, there he is again. Tool is monster. Oh, yeah. Cuidado. Into the ring. Cuidado, Black, Abdullah. Black, 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 well, look at this tool just cleaning out the Rob Black Tinsman. I mean, look at that monster crack. No effect on tool. Crack goes down. This guy is wow, man. Sabu and Abdul the Butcher still continue to punish each other. One thing we do know, Sabu still remains XPW World Heavyweight Champion undisputed. I have no idea where to focus here. There's so much action going the on. The West Siders attacking tool. Tool resisting. He's, look at the power of this tool. He's not even going down. Abdullah Butcher, another shot right to the larynx of Sabu. Sabu holding on to the security railing for balance. Abdullah Butcher going back. Hey, brother, what's this music, Chico? I don't I don't recognize this music. Wait a minute. I, I sure as hell recognize it. Could it be? Could it? Big Dick! Big Dick is back at XPW. You have got to be kidding me. I thought this guy what? was gone forever, man. I thought he was bombed from the XPW. What is Big Dick doing here? He's going to have to do Big Dick. There he is. Looks like he's going Can't after two. It. Yeah. He's taking care of Rob Black. He's taking care of his henchmen. Everyone's going down. This monster, Big Dick. Oh, man. It's great to see this guy back. Choke slam coming up. Boy, Big Dick is on fire here, man. What's the matter? No respect, Chico. No respect for the boss. Come on, brother. Look at this. Double choke slam coming up. Chronic, Jack, they both go down simultaneously. Rosano now, give me a break. Oh, I you can't think believe you're this. Big Dick? Hell no. I can't believe this, brother. What is happening here? The last time we saw Big Dick was in Hollywood last December at Mary Smith. And look at this. Josh Lacey just busted right up at Tracy Smothers. Oh, look at this total penetration from Big Dick on the Tracy Smothers. And Sabu going after Smothers now. Hey, man, this guy, was, where is this guy? I thought this guy was supposed to be in jail, man. What's he doing here? Look at pointing right at Rob Black. Rob Black, this is the guy we wanted to get at. Please get a kick. Yeah, yeah. Oh, come on, man. This is no good. Come on. Show respect, Chico. This is no good. Come on, man. You're going to pay for this, brother. You are going place. to pay for this. He wants a table. Looks like and Sabu's got one. Sabu's got a table. Oh, yeah, he's calling for it. Rob Black, you're going to get it. Obviously, Big Dick's been watching it. He knows what's been going on. And he's come back. Don't slam into the table. Hey, where's Abdullah, man? What happened to Abdullah? Come back out, man. Hey, Abdullah, come on back out, Chico. Like I said before, Rivera, no honor among Steve. Oh, two taking care of crack. He's crazy. It's like a street, like a circus with three or four rings here in the Sport Arena. All the action is all over the place. All I got to say is welcome back, Big Dick Dudley. Unbelievable. Josh Lazy busted open. Look at Lazy trying to talk. He's losing the blood from his head. Listen to the fans here. Thousands of them. Pandemonium. I mean, come on. Rob Black.
ladies and gentlemen, this is absolutely disgusting. I cannot believe this act of disrespect, esta falta de respeto de este, de este ladrón, este, this guy is a criminal, he should be in jail. Wait a minute, wait a minute Rivera, this is XPW, this is Sabu, this is Big Dick Dudley, this is John Slazy, this is great, you can hear the fans, welcome back Big Dick. Get your official XPW merchandise, t-shirt of the Messiah, Homeless Jimmy, Hungry Homeless and Hardcore. Don't cross the boss's wife, I'm talking about Lizzie Borden. The official XPW logo t-shirt, this ain't your daddy's wrestling. Tag team superstars, the West Sider, Sabu, Scarred for Life. White Trash, Johnny Webb, Fried Chicken, and Ass Kicking, our official XPW embroidered baseball cap with front and back logo. XPW's home videos of Lizzie Borden, Christy Miss, XPW TV's The Revolution Will Be Televised, Baptized in Blood, Hardcore Conception, and 8x10 Glossies of your favorite XPW stars, get your official XPW merchandise today. Visit XPW's official website at www.xpwrestling.com or call the XPW hotline at 818-779-6475. Do you think you have what it takes to become a pro wrestler? Then check out The Asylum, the official pro wrestling training school of XPW. For more information, call 818-779-6479 or log on to www.xpwrestling.com. July 22nd, live at the LA Sports Arena, XPW presents the one-year anniversary of Spectacular. In the main event, XPW champion, Sabu, puts the title on the line against his most formidable foe as Rob Black brings Terry Fox to XPW. Their battles are legendary, and now XPW will experience the carnage. Tickets to the Super Show available at all ticket pass or locations. July 22nd, 8 p.m., the LA Sports Arena, Rob Black says to Sabu and Lazy, go fuck yourself.